Welcome to Every Morning Tai Chi, where you can feel energized, calm, and centered all at the same time. So we'll begin with the feet together or as close as you can. Hands can come to the lower abdomen. You can take a few deep breaths, whichever way feels good for you. Breathing in and breathing out, arriving in the body. As you breathe in, the belly expands. As you breathe out, the belly returns toward the spine. We call this the belly breath or abdominal breathing. Creating relaxation, centering, coming into the present moment. And on the next inhale, you can hold the breath at the top just for a moment, then let it out with a big sigh. Ah, just letting out tension and stress. The hands can float down by the sides. And as you breathe in, the arms float up. A circle in front, gather in the energy, bring it into the heart. Send it down toward the earth, sinking the chi. Breathing in, gather. Breathing out, directing down. Nice and easy, nice and slow. Feeling all the sensations that you can. One more time, sink the chi. And then from here, step one foot out to the side. Either foot, the arms float up in front. Just to about shoulder height. Then the arms get heavy, floating down, the knees and hips soften, opening the door, rising up, floating down. Breathing in, breathing out. One more time, open the door. All right, this time the arms float out to the sides like you're spreading your wings. The arms float down, the palms face up, they float up the midline, pressing up overhead, then floating out and down, holding up the sky, like a good morning stretch, opening the shoulders and chest, decompressing the spine, creating space. Gentle stretch, one more time, holding up the sky. This time the hands float up to the heart. One hand pushes up, the other pushes down, connecting the sky and the earth. Switching sides. Keeping the spine neutral at first. This time, if you want, you can do a side bend, just easing in. And then once more to the other side. This time, bottom hand comes up, push to the corner, the other hand pushes behind. Coming back to center, push to the other corner. The dragon spreads its wings. This time, if you want, you can turn a little more. Pivoting on the feet, letting the back heel come up. And then once more to the other side. From here, the back hand swings around as if it's gliding on the surface of the water. The other hand comes around, the dragon swings its tail. Sending out little waves into the distance. Once more. And then from here, the hands come together. They float right in front of the heart. And then step one foot out a little bit wider. And then from here, softening the hips and knees, melting down. Then as you rise up to the side, the fingertips point up. Coming back to center, other side, swimming dragon, heart one. And down, looking to the opposite side, and then one more time. Right, this time the hands turn onto their sides and drift right across the eye level, and then across the heart, and then lower abdomen. Swimming dragon part two. Floating back up, drift across for another round, opening the wrists, the shoulders, Feeling the flow. And then release, round out, hug the tree, soften. From here, the fingertips dip down in towards the earth. The hands come forward, they float all the way up and over, and then down the center line of the body, like you're holding a column of air, digging in the garden. Breathing in, breathing out, one more time. Then reverse direction, the hands float up. They drift out and down, 
coming back up the midline as we harvest from the garden. As always, it doesn't matter how low you go, just being kind to yourself. All right, this time, round out, hug the tree, and soften the arms open wide. The Santier scoops under the other one on top as you embrace the moon. Pivot on the heel, point the toes out to the side. The moon orbits the earth, circling around as if you're carrying something precious. Big circle, and then reverse direction, whichever way you were going, just go the other way. You might even start to feel a little tingling in the hands. That's the chi, the energy. And then hug the tree, bring it back to center, pivot on the heel, the toes face forward, the arms open. Then this hand scoops under, embrace the moon, pivot on the heel, point the toes the other way. The moon orbits the earth. Sometimes this one's called stirring the chi, in the cauldron of the body. All right, then reverse direction, circle it around. All right, then when you're ready, hug the tree, bring it back to center. Uh, step the foot in a little closer, either foot. The arms float all the way up and over. And then from here, they drift down to the side, nice and slow, and then down the other way, like you're going down a mountain trail. All the way down to the base of the mountain. And then when you get to the bottom, we'll gather the energy from the earth, bring it right back up to the mountain peak. And then other side, descending the mountain. Nice and slow, like an autumn leaf floating down from a tree. And then from here, the arms float out to the sides. About shoulder height, and then other side. This time, the arms float up, palms face away, and then drift right across the heart. And then back down, floating back up. Drift across, painting on the canvas, making nice, gentle brush strokes. Feeling the sensations, bringing mindfulness to the body, This time the arms float all the way up and over like a big wave. The chin circles. Coming all the way up just as much as you can. One more time. Nice way to open the shoulders and then reverse direction. The arms float up to shoulder height, palms face away, drift across the heart. Painting on the canvas. Breathing in, breathing out. As always, take as many breaths as you need. Then this time, the arms float all the way up and over, just as much as you can. And then back down, the chin circles. Breathing in. Ah. <sighs> out one more time. And then from here, hug the tree, bring it to center, and then soften. From here, the palms face down, right in front of the waist, and draw the hands out to the corner, circle around, coming back in towards the hip, then out to the other corner, making a figure eight as we polish the table. Just letting go of any tension in the shoulders. So this is something you can do at any point during the flow, either drifting side to side, or you can polish the table. All right, one more time. And then circle around, hug the tree. From here, the hands draw in towards the heart, shift the weight to one side, step out to the corner as you push the mountain in as you draw in, breathing out as you push. One more time, the push. All right, this time the palms face toward each other, the hands go out to the corner, 
palms face away from each other, they open, circling out and around, scooping under, and then back out to the corner, parting the clouds. Breathing in, open, sending energy to the heart and lungs. Breathing out, boosting the immune system as well. All right, this time step the front foot back in, the hands come back in toward the heart. Step, or shift the weight, then step out to the corner. And push. Breathing in. <sighs> Breathing out, one more time. Pushing the mountain. All right, this time the palms face toward each other. Hands go out to the corner. Palms face away from each other. Then they open, circling around, scooping under, parting the clouds. Really tuning into the body. See if you can feel the air between the fingers. One more time, parting the clouds. And then step the front foot back in. Round out, hug the tree. And then from here, step one, the arms open up. wide. The hands float down, the palms face up, one hand on top of the other. This hand here floats up and over, and then down the center line of the body. Other side, breathe in as the hand floats up. Breathing out, centering. Centering the mind. Centering the heart. Centering the spirit. One more time. This time both arms can float up and over just as much as you can. The hands float down as you soften the hips and knees. Circle the hands in front, gather in the energy, transform into loving kindness and self-compassion. One more time, open the heart. This time, making a diamond shape with the hands in front of the heart, press out opening the heart, sending out loving kindness to the world, like rays of light coming out of your heart. May all beings be free from suffering. May they be happy. May they be healthy. May they live with ease. And then turning your palms to face yourself, the hands come to the heart. May I be kind to myself. May I feel connected with all beings. May I love myself just as I am. Then the hands can float down to the lower abdomen and step your feet together or as close as you can. Close your eyes or keep a soft gaze. And let your body rock and sway ever so slightly. Bamboo in the wind. Feeling the sensations in the body. Feeling the sensations of the breath. And bringing your attention into your heart, creating an inner smile. Expressing gratitude to yourself for being here today. And then if your eyes were closed, you can slowly open them hands can come together in front of the heart. We can finish with a bow. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the session. If you feel like the world could use a little bit more mindful movement, then please share this video with a friend today, and I'll see you in the next class.